If you drove through US 30 and Flaw Road Tuesday morning, you might have seen this. The fiery wreckage after two semis crashed at the intersection. It's kind of tricky getting through there. Just last year, a stoplight was put in place at the intersection to improve safety. Drivers like Max Shermadine are questioning if it's accomplishing that. I don't think it's really helped because too many people don't know about it. David Perkins feels people ignore the light. David, you, you were saying you thought that the intersection is pretty dangerous yourself. Oh, very much so, since they put the light in. I would think it would be a lot better without the light. A lot of accidents, even with the traffic light, didn't make any, any changes. I mean, it's very dangerous over there. Martin Adorama drives through the intersection almost every day. What do you think the state can do to improve the safety of that intersection? Well, uh, probably additional highway or something, you know. In a sense, Adorama's wish is coming true. One NDOT spokesperson tells me the traffic light is temporary, and they have plans to put in a grade-separated interchange at the intersection. In the meantime, Adorama and the other drivers ask everyone else to be cautious. They have to be careful, you know, watching what you do and where you drive.